In Module 10, we meet another scientist with a moon crater named after him, the Italian scientist Avogadro. The work Avogadro did in the 19th century helps us measure small things like atoms and molecules using a unit of measurement called a mole. It sounds funny, I know, but it has nothing to do with small mammals who live underground. We also take a look at the true work of a chemist, working out how many atoms are involved in chemical reactions and predicting the weight of the products of the reaction. This is called something a bit funny as well, stoichiometry. But for the moment, you can think of it as how much stuff. So at the end of this module, you should be able to describe the concept of a mole, perform calculations involving moles and masses, define the molecular weight of a substance, and use the mole concept in conjunction with balanced chemical equations to determine relative amounts of products and reactants. Uncovering the secret life of matter is nearly at an end. It's been a pleasure guiding you on your journey. The concepts you've learned here will help you uncover further secrets as you move forward with your chemistry study in other courses. From Michelle and I, farewell and best wishes for your journey as scientists, chemists, professionals in the health field, or whatever passion you're working towards.